Today I just opened up Illustrator beta by accident and look what I found. Adobe just put back the new dimension tool. Also, if you want to check out how to install Illustrator beta, you can click on the upper right corner or you can click down in the description to check out that video. So if you click on it, we got a new bar popping up. As you can see, we got three options. So the first one is the regular dimension tool that we already know. And the second one is the angular dimension tool that we're going to check out real quick. And I'm going to also show you the rest of this. And I'm going to use this logo as a reference, which has has angles I'm gonna swap it from fill to stroke and I'm gonna go and select it click on the intersection point and drag it it is going to measure the angle this is 120 degree and I'm gonna go down we got here another angle going on increase we got 60 degree now check this out if I go here we got a couple of things if I pull it here it's gonna measure 120 on the right and I'm gonna pull it on the left now look at that. It is going to measure actually the exterior part of this shape, which is 240. Now the first one is the linear dimension tool, the classic that Adobe dropped at the very first. So all you need to do is now long click here and drag it upwards. So now this is how it's working. Now look at that. If I long click and drag it more like this, it is going to expand these lines also. Now when we're talking about packaging design, of course pixels is not good, but we can change it up by clicking on the dimension tool and you can see here at the properties is going to pop up all the settings which is a lot and if you go all the way up you can see the units you can change it and we got the millimeter I'm gonna select it go here and as you can see we got 92 millimeters and yeah, look at that how nice it looks for example we got this really really sharp arrow that I don't necessarily like you can customize these subtle things quite a bit so I'm gonna go to the menu and look at this we got arrow styles you can change up the arrows I'm gonna go with this for example and you also can see the arrow skill I'm gonna scale it up so let's test this out drag it and look at that we got new results with the pointing hand now we got also other options going on. You can see we got the line type. So this was like the solid line. Then we got like dashed lines and dotted lines. If you check out with the dashed lines, you're gonna have dashed lines. And you also can change up the font if you like. You also can change the size of the font. We got huge font. And not at least we got another tool, which basically is the radial dimension tool. So I'm going to pull up this example. This is basically measuring the dimensions of the circle. So let's say I'm going to measure this external circle. Yeah, look at that. It is going to create this line. For example, I'm going to put it here and it's going to measure it like that. And now I'm going to measure the smaller one, put it there. And now I'm going to measure the smallest one. Nice. And these are the new updates of the new dimension tool in Adobe Illustrator beta.